and it came against Northwest Missouri State, the reigning NCAA Division II national champion, in an exhibition game. As expected, the Blue Devils won easily, 93-60. Here were five observations from the game. 1. It's pretty clear Grayson Allen is going to be this team's primary scorer. His teammates looked for him early, and he was aggressive from the floor. He was the game's leading scorer with 23 points. He was 9 for 15 from the floor and 5 for 10 from the three-point line. 2. Wendell Carter has some post moves. Most of the talk about Carter was that he would be a defensive enforcer and would clean up the glass. But he showed he had some nice moves in the post too. Carter finished with 11 points, 10 of which came in the first half. He added 9 rebounds. 3. Gary Trent Jr. can score. Trent showed some flashes of potential in the blue-white scrimmage, but he was more consistent in the exhibition game. He knocked down five of his first six shots in the first half. Most shots were mid-range jumpers. He was the team's second leading scorer on Friday. He finished with 15 points on seven of nine shooting. 4. Duke was much taller than Northwest Missouri State, as will probably be the case against many other schools. But it gave up nine offensive rebounds to the Bearcats. The offensive rebounds led to 13 second chance points, which is something the Blue Devils will have to address before the team's first game. 5. Duke players wore black warm up shirts over their jerseys that read equality in white lettering.